I don't want to know. Franklin! What the fuck? Mm. I mean, what the hell going on here? Wait a minute. Franklin, what are you doing here? I live here. This half my house, too. So you say? Anyway, Magenta is reinvigorating my femininity. So make yourself scarce, boy. Go. Go. With pleasure. Go. Good. And stay out of trouble! Yeah, yeah. Bitch, you ain't no more of a man than me. I hear that. Gangsta shit, nigga! Look who's bizarre. Shut up, fool. With it, man. Oh, no, no. Show some respect here, nigga. That man, he couldn't hold down his back. Come on now. Damn, man. I got to spend my day with another middle-aged fool trying to recapture his youth. What this fool just say? Missed you, dog. Oh, oh. You missed me, huh? No, I ain't missed you. Your ass could have stayed gone for good. So I fucked your girl, mm -hmm. mugged your mom, mm -hmm. and better yet, I ain't thought about your ass in years. Ha, ha. You got jokes now, huh? Hey, but I see you doing well for yourself. Check that on that. Shit, I'm doing just fine. That's what I hear. But I know some sweet boys up in the pen that got bigger balls than you. You been doing your time looking at sweet boy balls? Uh -huh. Yeah, it's good to have confirmation. It's funny, but why you keep hanging around this clown, L? Shake this fool, we man. We from the same set, Fred. Why, why y'all niggas can't get along? Y'all been doing this shit for years, man. You know what, dawg? It's good you back home. Glad you here. Missed you, boy. Damn, you definitely got hit up inside. Hit up? Hey, hey. Yo, motherfucker, I know little niggas like you been turned out on the daily. I'm talking about being hit up, nigga, I swear, man. You ain't got no motherfucking respect. Motherfucker, I got respect for reality. Reality? All right. All right, you keep thinking that. Just keep thinking that, nigga. Shit, you gonna get yours. Fuck you. I swear, man. Resist. Come whoa, on, whoa, man. Whoa, cool out. Fuck, Chill, man. man. This motherfucker get on my goddamn nerves. The nigga get on my nerves, too, man. Part of the nigga charm, man. Hell, come on, man. Let's just bust a move, man. You gonna drive or what? Yeah. Drive away. Pick up this heat, nigga. Why? Business, nigga. Oh, business. Come on, bro. Y'all niggas act like girls. Shit, not me. Shit. Let's go to the gun store. Shit, homie, you gonna drop all that bread on that gear, you might as well get a haircut, too. Who fucking crazy-haired microphone motherfucker? I got a microphone I can shove right in your prison pocket. Nigga, you walk like a keister and shit in. He what? You know, when I went away, you punks was little homie, and I was a big homie. As soon as we get this shit, as soon as we get paid, homie. As soon as we get incarcerated, more like it. Ammunition, armorer to the stars. Hey, what's up, man? Firing range is in the back, and all our weapons are customizable. Oh, hell yeah! You can trick your blam blam out up in here. Quit all that. Just straight up artillery, man, all right? Don't y'all shut the fuck up. I got this, you clown. All right, homie, get your shotgun with the flashlight modification. Why the fuck am I the only one buying this? Because we got sheets, homie. Now shut the fuck up and come on. Man, we got some recycling to do. Come on, man. Send her off friends in La Puerta. Ooh, okay. You got some cans or some shit I don't know about? Nah, homie. We got
got ourselves a drug deal. Why do I get the feeling it's gonna be one of them deals gone wrong type situations? Now, see, that's that negative attitude Lamar was telling me about, nigga. You ain't getting nowhere thinking like that. The power of positive bullshit. You ought to be clenching your motherfucking vagina muscles with my hunt, nigga. After his bid, it probably be tight enough. This ain't new age shit. It's fact. You get what you get, fool. You been getting dick, but you... You ain't giving it, huh? Some Mark talk like that to an OG. <laughs> CGF has changed, man. No wonder the hood is so lame right now. Hey, man. Hey, we meet you here. Man, how'd you find this place? Homie said it up. This the kind of spot where we ain't gonna be disturbed. That's what the fuck worries me. I'm more of a hide the plain sight type of nigga. <laughs> what up, fool? What up, we got that shit, nigga, with a paper ass. Nigga, I'm talking about Buku Bill. More day. <laughs> What's up, boy? Everything cool? Yeah. Come on, man. What the fuck, man? You was just kidnapping this nigga. Oh, oh come, come on, on man. Oh, real. Yeah. real. D, my nigga, just got out crossing lines, did some time with some of your folks. Hey, look, look, look. This ain't about you, man. What? You know these niggas, though. Yo, what fuck, the fuck yeah. this trick talking about, man? Yeah, What's yeah, that? yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, see, 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 they put a nigga on TV, man, about some gang intervention. Shit. Hey, this ain't the police, dog. This some baller bullshit. Nigga, that's some bullshit. Fuck you. Hey, we been set up, nigga. This shit fucked fuck up. Fuck you, nigga. You. Ain't motherfucking shit. Oh, bitch ass ballers. We doing this or what? Come on. That fucking D set us up. You lay low, motherfucker. That ain't me. I can see that. Send that, that sucker to his dead homie. Never trust the baller, homie. Never trust you is the lesson I'm taking away from this shit. Cover me, homie. I'm gonna hit this. Fuck. Here again? Oh, fuck you. Man, I ain't going down for you. You going first next time, no fool. Shit, nigga. Get me off your dick. We too smart to get jumped. Family ain't no more. You fuck, sad. Fuck, fuck. Punk ass kid. <laughs> fuck you. Did you think to work out an exit while you set up this meat? There's always a way out, motherfucker, and we gonna find it. Baby G, this how I got you. Kill my ass, nigga. You go first. Stay after me. Man, it's cold in here. Get my eyes on. Get my eyes on. Fall back. Man, I deserve to get you. Send him back. We gotta go for this shit spread! You about to have a bunch of dead homies! You handled that fool! Yeah, and I handle him again! Many times does it take shit! We almost popped all these dudes! I'm gonna follow you for a minute! Baller! Never fucking learn! You gonna get chipped, old bitch ass baller! Oh, my God. 
Sounding more and more like a snee eye yes every day. Hell no, nah, yeah. nigga. I sound like somebody trying to make some paper and not get killed. He's a hook ass nigga. I told you. Go toss a salad, stretch mark ass bitch. We all good? Hell yeah, we all good. We did. Yeah, you fucking ain't right. We did. So here's the shot. Lester's offloading the gems. He knows a guy. Get us fifty cents on the dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Hell, we might actually have a little spending money left after we pay off that psychotic Mexican motherfucker. Whew. Cheers. So that's that, right? I hope so. The whole job, everything about it. Anyone who knows your file, what is wrong with you, Davy? Long time no see. And what about Trevor? If that fruitcake realizes, no, no, finds out you're alive, you are D-O-N-E fucked. Hey, don't worry about Trevor. Trevor's dead. Gotta be. Besides, I didn't have nothing to do with it. Whatever the hell it is you're talking about. Nothing. Really? Oh. Hey, <laughs> Albert Story had a lucky escape when the thieves ran straight into it. Yeah, I was just doing my job, and I said to this guy, hey, you gotta move these bikes. 
I don't know anything about that. <laughs> this other guy runs out of the shop, he pushes me over and says something like, you forget thousands of things every day. Make sure this is one of them. That's pretty scary. Back to you in the studio. You want to get lit now, sugar? Tre Trevor, baby, you want to you wanna smoke up now? Don't do it, Johnny. Don't do it. Trevor! You've been with my girl again? I'm speaking with you, asshole. Don't do it, Johnny. I told him, Trevor. I told him. We all get high. We all get high. But that don't make it right. Leave it. Crystal has got us, babe. Don't make it right. Don't make nothing right. That what you done with me. I'm telling Johnny, leave it. I ain't leaving nothing. Trevor, I'm talking to you, motherfucker. Where are you? What are you saying? Fucking my girl, man. It's wrong. Oh, I gotta fuck someone. You want me to fuck you instead? I is that the problem here? Take off your pants. Cowboy eyes. It's fuck. You think this is funny? Get them off! I told him to leave it, Trevor. I told him. Leave it. Leave it. Shut up, Ron. I'm about to. Fuck me a meth head, ain't I, cowboy? Get my boy sucked from his toothless gums. Fuck you, Trevor. Oh, I still love her. All right, cowboy. Hey, I know. Hey, come on. Shh. I don't mean that to buy a mess. I just... I know. I'm messed up. I know, cowboy. It's okay. I just saw a fucking ghost and I gotta hear your crap! Get up! Get up! Fuck you then! Wait! <laughs> Fuck! Don't be cowboys forced our hand! We gotta find the rest of the lost! Wait! This ghost I saw. His name is Michael Townley. Sounds like he's living in Los Santos. Find him. Really? Uh... My cousin's there, but... I don't... Find him! Wade! You just mean I don't have to come see the bikers? We're in a hurry, but not that much of a hurry. But if we bury Johnny in the desert, and then quiet down that bitch Ashley he was in, then they don't need to find out about it. You think it's clever to disrespect women? Disrespect? What? I wasn't disrespecting, I was just saying we should kill her. You called her a bitch. Ain't you got a mother? Everyone got mothers, at least one. We're going up to that farm on the right? That's where they're meant to be. Here! Ow, ow, ow. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, you seen Ashley? Johnny's looking for her. Well, you know, as a matter of fact, I just did, just 10 minutes ago. Yeah, I saw her on the end of this penis here. Uh, Johnny ain't gonna be cool if you messing with her again. Oh, really? Well, you don't think so, huh? Well, why don't we just ask him then, huh? Hey, hey, cowboy. You mind that I fucked your old lady? Sorry. What was that? What? What? No? No? You don't mind? Oh, because you're a dead man? And the only sentient party he left is this little bit of brain and the gristle on the end of my boot? Well, thank you very much, cowboy. Bullshit! Oh, I like it. Denial. That is first part of the grieving process, brothers. Now let's all hold hands, huh? Well, it looks like you got something you want to say, huh? You got something you need to say? This better be bullshit. Oh, where are you guys going, huh? Let's go, ladies! All right. We follow the van back to the rest of them. Then the lost MC are out of this region for good. We can't fuck with the van, but we can drop those bikers. They're gonna change a plan? We'll go faster if you jump overboard, friend. Whoa! Did 
you see the look on their faces? We scared them, didn't we? Yeah, thank fuck they didn't make you for the harmless idiots you are. You need some deep belts back here, or straps or something. I only keep things in the back I don't mind losing. Oh. Maybe you should hold off shooting the van. All righty, Root. Now we just sit on this guy till he gets to them. You gotta slow it up, man. That's a sharp left. Uh, I can't see us taking out all the bikers this go, boss. I mean, there'll be some by that airstrip, and some over, you know, by that... If not today, their time will soon be upon them. If we go off the side on the left there, we should make it across. Sure. Once you know, you can drop me and Wade at the trailer. Maybe bring Chef to finish them. We do this now, Ron. All of us. Right on top of it. Where are your boys at? Bricks. Oh, look, look, they're pulling up. He did it, Trevor. They're stopping. Watch the entrance, boys. No one leave. It's gonna be so He's about my express permission. Uh. Uh. Clip. Uh. Man down. What the you fuck? You're fucked. I'm fucking you. See him. It's one thing messing with tweaked out bikers, but the Aztecas? Man! The Aztecas? It's just a name. Is he Illuminati as well? And a wacky? I'm one of the lizard people. I got this Chinese contact who can meet at the end. He'll buy all the meth we can cook. Our enterprise ain't just about meth, it's about guns too.
Soggy friend, you are out of business. The lost MC are out of business. The guns and crank in this area go through Trevor Phillips Enterprise, or they ain't going. Saying something don't make it true. I'll go away, man, but my people, you have been told. I thought you was crazy, man, not stupid. Oh, that feels better. You sure mean business, D. Come on, T, let's go. This is an unprecedented turn of events. I always said I was gonna take over. <laughs> People say all kinds of stuff when they're three days into a smoking party. You calling me a bullshitter, friend? Clearly not. No way. You're a man of your word as evidenced by said events. If I say something is going to happen, it's going to. Maybe not today or tomorrow, but as soon as the moment is opportune. Understood. Yes, sir. If I say I'm fucking dead, then fucking dead I am. I'm not gonna raise my balding head on a beach in 10 years time saying, all is well. Is this about the ghost? Michael fucking Donnelly, yes it is. Well, you told me about him, your old running buddy. And who is the other one? Brad. Who's the other one? Locked up in a federal penitentiary. When he finds out Michael survived that job. Yeah. What do you think happened? I knew what happened. I wouldn't be bemoaning these last ten years I've spent in ignorance. Get out of the car, Ron. I need time to think. Run! You're still banned. What about these two? Whoever wins gets banned. He's won. Ban him. I can't ban him. He's my goddamn husband. He's young enough to be your son. Ain't the internet a beautiful thing, honey? Anyway, I saved your husband. Now get me a drink. I got a meeting. Okay, but any more bodies turn up in my bar. I swear, I will not serve you. Mr. Phillips. Ah, uh, here he is. Yes, Mr. Chang, pleasure to meet oh, you. No, I am Mr. Chang's humble translator. Mr. Chang now. You all speak Spanish, speak it to each other! Mr. Tao Chong is... Pleased to meet your acquaintance. Oh, yeah, he seems it. 
我说，人事，你真是太好了！啊，你有空就加的来分杯的我，这真是我人生中最美好的一刻。What is wrong with him? 就是这个，就是这个，来来来来来 ！I'm out. No, don't go. Please, I beg you. If you go, his father kill me. Why do I give a fuck? You don't. But we hear that Trevor Phillips Corporation is serious business. We pay good price. Things work out. We partner. Make big money. <laughs> I'm rushing. Well, let me show you the operation. This is us. This crank for his own personal consumption? No, no. Mr. Cheng Senior is very specific. He wants a good, reliable source of methamphetamine. We will buy from you here and distribute using established networks. I'm worried that might dilute what our operation's all about. We're part of the slow meth movement, bio-regional, locomores only. You asked me to come say goodbye. Get Trevor. We ain't got long. Whoa, 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 whoa. Manner, chef. These are our guests, all right? We got Mr. Cheng and his humble servant. Hey, no uh, <laughs> Nice to meet you. Trevor, we ain't got long till they get here. Everything in its time, all right. Gentlemen, please. Come check out the storage facilities. Oh. Nice, right? There you go. <laughs> Apple room inside. Mr. Cheng, please, sir, if you will. Let me out! No. Hello, Bob. Tour will recommence shortly, gentlemen. Should we get the gun? Yes, chef. Help me! Uh, if I knew we were having visitors, what is that, a little spring clean? Ortega has always been cool with us before. Through Shastavai, come on!
Get back inside and clean up the lab! All right, time to recommence the tour, gentlemen. <laughs> I think we have seen quite enough. I'll swing by and sign the contract, all right? Just ignore the bodies. Hey, Trevor, are we still gonna cook that match? Fuck yeah! What's going on, Ron? They were here for you. Here for you. Who was here? Them bikers. After you killed Johnny K. And they damage my stuff, huh? They smash up my home, damage my soul. This, 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 this statue here of impotent rage, this fucking meant more to me than Johnny K meant to anyone, and they smashed it. Those pathetic midlife crisis. Hog riding, shaven headed, fruity leather, chap wearing fucking assholes. They're assholes, Trevor. They are. They're chap wearing assholes. Wait, 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 you little shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, Michael fucking Townley, right? Bitch wife, two kids, 45. Find them. Go Santo, kick a big, big place, Trevor. There's lots of people. You are fucking useless. Huh? Find out who did that fucking robbery, all right? And if Michael Townley lives there, or anyone matching his description, I'm gonna kill you and your fucking cousin. Am I being clear now? Yes, Trevor. Thank you. Right. Now smile. Yeah. All right. As that. Run over. <laughs> now, Ron. Shall we go? I cannot believe that they fucking destroyed my statue of infant rage. The cheek! Huh? The fucking cheek. I gotta swing by ammunition. Go to Sandy Shores Airfield. Check it out. Come in! Come in! I'll come in your ear when I get a hold of you. Oh! I'm not buying anything. I need a sniper rifle with a high power scope. They say they support local business. Well, we're about to find out if that's true. Melvin! How you feel about brand synergy, huh? TP Industries. That sniper on your wall looks like it'll do the job. She'll do nicely. There's the necessary magnification. Get that look off your face. I know you sold Cletus' gun and he ain't got three brain cells. Run! Run, I got the gun. Meet me at the water tower just north of the airfield. Roger that, Trevor. But you gotta look out, because there's bikers all over this airstrip. Of course there are! Two planes are touching down at the field on a weapons run. We're gonna wait till the right time and appropriate them. We are? Yes, we are. Uh, I'm up here. Oh. I don't see the hardware, but I do see a hell of a lot of fight. Hardware's not here yet. Coming up. I'm up the tower, Trevor. We gotta wait till you can slip in there unnoticed. Should give you the time to plan a route to the gas tank you're rigging up to blow. Really? Enough waiting. This is your moment, Ronald. 
Whenever you get a doubt in your mind, I want you to remember that I'm watching you through the scope of a high-powered rifle. Right, Trevor. Right, right. Got it. Now, relax. The ATV can only take you so far. Park it and don't let them spot you. Can you see me, Trevor? Trevor? You see me? You wouldn't believe this, Ron. One of these assholes is having a seizure or something. That's me! That's me! Don't shoot! Well, get a move on! I'm moving! Just keep me covered, okay? I saw a guy by the tower. I shot him. Now keep moving. Come on! Keep it moving. Shit! I hear an engine! They're gonna see that guy you shot! I already shot the light, so you can calm down. Now, don't smoke the guy in the van until he stops and gets out. Get me to 
where the lost were likely to be sending them. Or? Or? Or other neighbors, those in the south, our Mexican brethren. I'd assume you got all kinds of connections in Canada. Why would you make an assumption like that? It's obvious. Why is it obvious? Spell it out for me before I order you to fly that plane into a mountain. Um, uh, because of where you used to operate. Weren't you pulling scores in North Yankton and running cargo over the border? Oh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, sure I was. There's a flare in the water. I'm guessing it's them. It better be. Drop your load. Military base coming up. Fly low. We don't want to show on their radar. delivered, Ron. Now remember, if you beat me to the airstrip, I'll butcher your carcass and wrap you in cheesecloth. You wouldn't really do that to me, would you? Beat me and you'll see. Uh, I ain't a trained Air Force pilot like you. I can just about get where I'm going, but I don't got much choice over whether it's fast or slow. Then get better at it, or fly through a barn. Would a barn slow me down? Yeah, it might do. Or it might kill you instead. I'm just gonna fly normal. And I'll rely on you getting there quicker. You're braver than I thought. Stay low over those wetlands, boss. So the guns are going to Mexico? Mexico, yeah. Guy in the boat is Oscar Guzman. He's in with the cartels. If there's a market, this could be a way to expand the business. Like I hadn't thought of that? 
We might be able to buy into Oscar's thing, but leave that to me, Ron. I'm sorry to ask this, but does your contact pay well for this kind of shipment? Because I've got those lawyer fees for the divorce and my settlement costs. Oh, he pays. Better than any in this sorry country. That's good to hear, man. We'll talk about the exact split when we're grounded, okay? All right, T. I think that was adequate restitution for my impotent rage statue. That was a mighty fine statue, Trev. That was a mighty fine piece of plastic shit. But there is no price for emotional attachment. I mean, you might forego your cut to uh, alleviate my heartache. I might? Yeah, I mean, I will. Good idea. We don't have time to dwell on that now. Because we got more runs, Ron. If there is one thing that they need south of that big fence, it is guns. <laughs> Trevor Phillips Industries. Technical expertise, hmm? managerial innovations, unstoppable. Oh, that's right. Now go. I need to make it. Lormas. Sure as shit are one dumb ignorant white trash hillbilly Wallace. You're damn right! <laughs> Chang, spreadsheet. Let's head outside and talk terms. La 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 la. Right in. Gentlemen, I think I have proved that my organization can handle weight. And I think I have proved that my organization is a reliable supplier. In short, it's you and me. Now give me some of that goddamn X. 
I'm afraid we want to go down a different path. What? We want to explore other opportunities. Why, Jia Huo? Why, sir? Because I will help you calm down. Shut the fuck up! Our boss, Mr. Cheng's father, wants something a little larger. We want to move drugs, perhaps guns. This is my life's work. I mean, since I was a little kid, I, I dreamt big. You know, I've always wanted to be an international drug dealer and, and a weapons trader. All right, so I'm begging you. Let's make this happen. I'm very sorry. You're sorry? You're fucking sorry? I just spilled my fucking guts out to you, and you say to me you're sorry. Who are you working with? Hmm? Who? I'm not at liberty to say. Oh, no, no, no. You're at fucking liberty. In fact, I'd say you are obliged. <laughs> who? Fucking who? 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 <laughs> the O'Neill brothers. The O'Neill brothers, huh? Yeah. You shitting me? No. Because those fucking O'Neill brothers, I hear a little birdie telling me that they have a bit of a problem, since one of them's going to have to be surgically removed from the skull of the other. Fuck you guys and fuck them. <laughs> Crap! I just spoke to that maniac Trevor. He's coming. Get down to the meth lab to protect him. I hope he don't get through these idiots, but we know they're idiots. Come on, let's go see them Chinese fellas. Oh, how many brothers you got, you inbred freaks? I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'll kill the lot of you, and I'll torch your cookhouse.
here. You're not even hidden. Have you got it? I've been trying, Trevor. I've been trying. Come on over here, all right? I ain't gonna hit you. I've been trying. I know, I know. I thought you said you weren't gonna hit me. I thought you said you were gonna find fucking Michael Townley. There's two Michael Townley living in LS. One is 83, and the other one is at kindergarten. I asked a teacher to put him on the phone just to be safe. She threatened to call the cops. I ain't no molester, Trevor. Shut up act... before I molest you, all right? Now, is there anything else? I, I look through the phone directory. I did find a, a Michael DeSanta, about the right age, married with two kids. What's his wife's name? Amanda. Amanda? Yeah. You're a genius, you moron. Come on, uh, come here. Uh, Woo! Uh, uh, don't you ever not tell me things I want to know. Sorry, Trevor. Run, you little bastard. Get out here. We're going to Los Santos. Are we? Not you, me and Wade. What about me? You're CEO of Trevor Phillips Enterprises. Find us some business so that we can make some money and tidy my shit up. Let's go, wait, come on. I'm driving. You can jerk me off if I get bored. I'm joking. Oh. You can suck me off. Are we gonna stop for ice cream? Um, <laughs> so, so we're headed to Los Santos then? Soon. I gotta make a stop. Oh, what's your stop? Ice cream? Where are your people at in Los Santos? It's just my cousin there, Floyd. He bunked in with his girlfriend someplace called Vespucci Beach. So, uh, what's your stop? Family's important, Wade. It's not as important as the man that's employed you, mentored you, and fed you amphetamines this last year, but it's important. We gotta pay this cousin a visit. I ain't seen him in a while, Trevor. All the more reason to drop by. Okay, uh... That might be nice, but where are we stopping on the way? Cause you know, I'm getting kind of wet over here. For fuck's sake, another chapter of the lost has descended on this fine town. Looking to mourn, maybe revenge their dead. I was thinking me and you could pay our respects. Camp's up here. I'll wait till dark before I drop in again. Trevor, 
Lube up your eye hole, fucker! Cause I'm gonna fuck your tiny mind, huh? I'm about ready to turn you into roadkill! Ah, please! Don't turn me into anything! I just wanna be away! Are we nearly there yet? No, way. Are we nearly, nearly there? You keep this up, you're not gonna get there at all! Can you tell me a story? No, way. Let's play a game then! You know animal, mineral, or vegetable? I'll go first. I'm nanotechnology. Uh, you're what? Ugh. Damn it. I, hey, I gave it away. I wasn't, I wasn't supposed to say what I am. I'll start again. Animal, vegetable, or mineral? Hey, hey, hey. How about this? I'll tell you a story if you promise never to speak again. I like stories. Of course you do. This story's about a boy called Tr Tr uh, Trisha. Is Trisha a boy name? It doesn't matter. Sounds weird. He was weird. He was the smartest, toughest, weirdest kid in Canada. Well, in the Canadian border region of America. Okay. Right there. Los Santos. The end of the fucking earth. Oh! Get, get, get! Get, get, get! So, this is Bo Santos. I guess it is. I always wanted to come here. But you got stuck in the desert. It's still San Andreas. Best part of the state. So, Michael, this is where dead men come back to life. It's been nearly ten years, but you'll keep for another day or so, huh, old friend? Mother fucking fuck! I dreamed for you! You weren't even fucking dead. You were my best friend. Well, guess who's coming to shit on your doorstep, you fuck! Los Santos, the city of shitheads. Where else would you be? Floyd over in Vifuji Beach. Floyd over in Vifuji Beach. Will you tell me the story about that boy, Trisha? Ah, yeah, yeah. Where were we? Right, 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 right. So, this kid, he could fly planes. So, he signed up for the Air Force to fly all day long and bomb villages and maybe, just maybe, drop the nuke. And it was all going well until one day, just before he got his wings, an evil witch in charge of psychological evaluations told him he was unstable and grounded him for life. That's terrible. It was. Sent him to a deep pit of doubt. Despair. And just then, just, just as he hit rock bottom, he met a fat, silver-tongued troll under a bridge. That's cool. What was the troll's name? Mike. M Michelle. A lady troll? Yeah, he had tits like one, but no, no, he, he was a boy. Michelle is a funny name for a boy. Well, this was a funny boy. He sat under his bridge, robbing anyone who passed him by. Sometimes he'd go into town and rob the shops and inns and such. And he persuaded our hero that maybe he should rob people too. And you know what? Little Trisha did rob people. And little Trisha was good at it. And they lived happily ever after? For a while. Until the troll met another troll in a strip club. And they fell in lust. And he bought her a pair of fake troll tits. Even bigger than his real troll tits. So she could make more money stripping. Maybe a little on the side. Oh! Maybe a little on the side without call work. But you didn't hear that from me. Wow. And then she pushed out a pair of little trolls, and the big bad troll under the bridge went soft. Hold on, what? So little Trevor made a new friend called Brad, and he was thinking about cutting Mike off when it all went to shit, and Mike got killed and Brad went to jail. It all the man. Change or am I missing something? Shut up! And then the fat, ugly troll came back from the dead. Oh, oh, we're near Floyd's house. I've seen it on the iPhone map. I'll give you directions. Now keep going. 
It's straight here. This one's a right. Just keep on a minute. This is the place. I think it is, at least. Floyd! Floyd! Come up here, Trevor! Floyd, it's me, Wade! Who? Me, Wade, your cousin! Who? Your cousin! Fuck! He's come to visit you, you rude fuck! Now get up off the floor and fix me a fucking drink! Oh, you wait! <laughs> I heard you was off smoking meth somewhere. No, not somewhere. Here, he's gonna smoke meth here. Give me a fucking lighter. You can't smoke here. Hey, this is my girlfriend's place. She's at a business conference. You can't smoke here and you can't stay here. How's it going, cousin? It's been a while. Yeah, I ain't seen you since you was caught in Evelyn's bed. A guy would never prove. You gotta go, both of you. My girlfriend, she'd kill me if she knew I had guests. Well, it's not much of a girlfriend if she don't like your family. Now, would you get me a fucking drink? I'm not gonna ask you again. Oh, yeah. Okay. Wait, uh, I ain't got no booze. Well, then you go out and fucking get me something. You go, too. to blame for the mess these kids are in. You are either drunk, or you're staring miserably at the clouds, or you're out there doing God only knows what. Oh, yeah. I done horrible by you. Pulled you out of a Midwestern trailer park, got you a big mansion in Rockford Hills. Hell, the only thing you gotta worry about anymore is what part of your body you wanna have chopped off or sucked out of you. Screw you, Michael. Ah, but you won't. I was faithful to you up until I found you in a stripper. I would divorce your ass if I could. You are nothing but a murdering, cheating hypocrite. Thank you, Michael, whatever the fuck our fake last name is. You have ruined my serenity yet again. My yoga is fucked. Oh, is that what they're calling it now? You and your fucking yoga. Did someone say yoga? Oh, hello, baby and darling. Namaste. Namaste. You must be Miguel. Namaste. Nah, Michael, fuck yourself. Michael! You've got to work on your anger, brother. It's killing you. Yeah, hey, tell me about it. Ah! There you are, you little shit. Are you looking for this? Ah, 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 ah. No. Very funny. You know, you're a real asshole. What did you just fucking say to me? Stop it! You two, you, you're ruining my fucking yoga! Somebody say yoga? Trevor? Michael. Hey. It's good to see you, man. Mm, yeah, I bet it is. Of course, I'm not the one that's been resurrected. Ain't this grand? Yeah, well. I got in a bit of an awkward situation. Mm, you're telling me, bro. Yeah. One of those. Fake your own deaths to your best buddy, and then run off with the dough, and then live in the big mansion. Awkward situations. That's one way of looking at it. Yeah, do you have any other ways of looking at it? Because I am all about it. It was a long time ago now. I've been in witness protection, I still am. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Where are my manners, right? <laughs> Amanda, it is good to see you. Oh, I missed you. You used to be fatter. I got a nice new tits, by the way. Jimmy, you, you used to be thinner. But, uh, can't blame you. Who are you? Namaste. I'm Fabian. Good. 
Where's Tracy? Where's your sister, Jim? Um, sh she's, uh, she's, uh, she's trying out for TV. She's what? Yeah, she's auditioning for Fame or Shame. Fame or Shame? The fuck are you talking about? You know, it's that talent slash skills show. She loves it, you guys know that. What's her talent? Dancing. Oh, Christ. She's a horrible dancer. Mike. She might disagree with you on that. Jesus. Now? Now? Where? Um, the Maze Bank Arena. Oh, Tracy, baby, you know, yeah. Let's go. We go get her. We? Yeah, we. What, are you gonna stand here and argue while your daughter becomes a national laughing stock? Huh? You're worse than I thought. Now let's go. Come on. I was making myself a juice. Brock, raw kale, fish oil. This recipe I got is packed with nutrients, fibers, vitamins, and it don't taste bad. I'll send you the recipe. Anyway, get this. I'm making it. The blender slips, juice goes everywhere. I'm about to clean it up when I find this bag of shit. Up when I find this bag of grass. Big fucking bag. Jimmy's, right? Okay, just that moment, Amanda comes in. Sees me there. I didn't ask for a blow by blow of how you lost your last ounce of masculine pride. I wanted to know what you've been doing for a decade. Easy T. Don't T me. Hey, if anyone needs kale, my friend. I'm beyond Pam. Okay? It's too late for kale. And it's magical powers to have any effect on me. Fine. Or yoga. Or talk therapy. I'm a crank, cannibalism, an incest kind of guy. Oh, don't worry, T. They'd skip that talk and go straight to shock treatment with your ass. You two chilled out to say my name, you fat slob. You two relaxed and you laid back Los Santos embarrassment, huh? Is one letter all you can bring yourself to wrap your slothful lips around? Whoa, dude, you do not let the fuck up. I've got ten years worth of venting to do. To let up, my friend, is a long way off. Bang, bang! Do what the fuck you want! What? Well, I, I want to save your daughter from making an ass of herself. Oh, really, man? Really? What is it? Money? Come on, you dipshit. Ah, that host, man, he's like any closeted TV presenter. Bitter as fucking vinegar. Where the fuck are they? Hello, sir. May I please have your name? Where the fuck is Tracy Townley, huh? Tracy fucking DeSanta. Fuck, screw that. Where the fuck's Laszlo? <laughs> All right. Yeah. <laughs> that was really. All right. It's the auditions, Fame or Shame, season 14, right here in Vinewood, San Andreas. Coming up next, it's Tracy DeSanta. Judges, Tracy DeSanta. Yes. Hi. All right. Tracy's a dancer, but she also likes acting, modeling, and working with children. That's, that's beautiful. You're so original, like a, a basket full of puppies or a rainbow or a pile of puke. Who are these clowns? That's my dad and... Trevor? Two dads. Oh, <laughs> Great. Wow. Very San Andreas. What are you guys doing here? Yeah, what are you doing here? Okay, I'm Relax, chill, make yourself at home. We've got a little show to do here. Three, two, one. All right, it's fame or shame for Tracy DeSanta. Music. With a Take what your daddy's gave you, honey. So crazy. Mm. And now, step a 20 in Oh! <laughs> Fuck, you do something about this? Uh, uh, that's enough. Oh, oh, I said that's enough! Oh, hey, oh, hey, 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 I got security. Security! Why'd you fucking Hold say? Come on, big guy. Come on. Right there. No. Come on. No. Fuck. No. Come here, you little 
shit! Go home, right now, Tracy! Hey, where you running off to? Ah, they towed us! We gotta take the truck. There, we take the truck. I got a deposit on that truck! Hey, take a left up here. How can you sit there and watch your daughter get treated like that? Hey, you raise a daughter in this town, you get used to stunts. It's poor parenting. Now, thanks for the fucking feedback. It means a lot coming from you. We're gonna flatten his toy car in this big rig. Don't move her. Fucking Laszlo. I knew he was an asshole. Just push him off the fucking road! It's only a battery car, come on! This ain't exactly a race. We gotta go to the left. Ah, the little bastard's going up through the train tracks. We can have a little fun with him, but let's not try to kill this prick, all right? When we crush his little toy car, who knows what'll happen to him? He took a left. I knew this city would be full of douchebags. Can we speed it up a little, huh? Maybe by throwing your fat carcass over the side. Right, right here. I just hope that broke your goddamn neck. Look, you went right. Can't get enough of the celebrities, can you? Ten fucking minutes in LS. Shut up. That cocksucker might be famous, but oh. We'll get him! We'll get him! Well, we're sure taking our time about it. Ha ah, ah, ha! He's going down into the L.S. River. I can see that. I hate that closeted man whore on the TV. I hate him on the radio. I hate him even more in person. He was never funny. What the fuck? Is he slowing down? Hey, 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 guys, you run out of batteries, huh? I didn't mean anything oh, by it, all right? Oh, yeah? Well, that little girl sat on my lap when she was two years old, and I swore to God that I would rip the fucking skin off anyone who fucking wronged her. I'm just a dumb A-list celebrity trying to entertain America, okay? I got a lot of stuff going on right now, dude, besides you trying to kill me. Now I got multiple sexual harassment lawsuits, plus I'm an addict, all right? And I've relapsed. I can't stop jacking, dude. I jack in traffic. What's your tip, huh? I mean, aside from love and Dude, haven't you seen my show? It's not live, it's not funny. It's my genius, I got no fucking talent. You clearly ain't being humble, T. <sighs> you proved your point. <sighs> this is your daughter. You should be wanting to rip the fucking ponytail off the back of this guy's head. And you! Huh? Uh, uh, okay. I want you to dance sexy, celebrity, mm -hmm. I mean, I need music, or... Are you trying to fucking annoy me, huh? I'll, I'll dance. Good. <laughs> all right, all right, now drop it like it's high, all right? I want to see you get nice and low. Oh, come on. Lower, oh, right. lower, oh, come on. No. Oh, please don't kill me, okay? Uh -huh. I'm supposed to be on a magazine cover next week. All right, all right, please, come no, on, get no. off. Take off, go, now. Before I change my mind. I got it all on my camera, you fucking pussy. The world's gonna see your shit. <laughs> I'm going home. How the fuck did you do it without me for nine years, huh? <laughs> Dave. We need to talk. I was about to tell you the same thing. Okay. 
Meet me at Galileo Observatory as soon as you can get there. Okay. Davey, how you doing? About as good as can be expected, but the news is not good. I don't know what you're talking about. I know you did that fucking jewelry job. Davey, seriously, you're imagining things. Fuck you. All right. I did it. Arrest me. You know what? You'll be saving my life. Because you called it, motherfucker. What? You called it. Trevor. A couple days ago. We haven't really talked about anything either. But if the when he starts asking questions about why you're not feeding worms south of the Canadian border. Oh, we got problems. And yeah, no shit. We're in it. Together. So if your problems are my problems, then I guess that means that my problems are sort of your problems. Uh-uh. Nope. Or if I lose my job, someone comes into my office, starts reading my files, they'll see the things I did. I know a lot of stuff. I can cop a plea, get five years, but you... Fuck you, you ungrateful prick. I made your career. No. And we better go about saving it together. Because you and I both know we can't let it go to shit now. What do you need? This guy. Ferdinand Carroll. The agency claims he's dead. We at the Bureau think they're full of crap. We think he's being debriefed someplace. So? Apparently, he has information which will put me and my superiors out of circulation. His agency. Fuckers have got the coroner's office locked down. We need you to verify the body. 
How the hell am I gonna get in here? Well, you've played dead before, haven't you? Oh. Oh. I have always kind of liked you. Call me when you wake up. What we got? Uh, John Doe, white male, overweight, in his late 40s, possible coroner. Take a peek. The fat deposits on his hips and abdomen suggest a fondness for leader burgers. Probably about to find one in his gut, still in its wrapper. Right next to the bottle of scotch and a pack of red ones. See the broken capillaries around the nose? Alcoholic. I wouldn't take any bets on that. Oh, Jesus! Back from the dead, motherfucker!
business! Gotta get out of town. Man, I ain't exactly got nowhere to go. Well, then take a trip. A long trip. What the fuck is going on? Thanks, all right? You know, I told you I know people. Feds who looked after me when I retired. You did? Yeah, I did. I mean, I think I did. I don't know. Shit, Jesus Christ, Franklin. I got so many stories, I can't even keep them straight. I'm full of shit. Yeah, but your full of shit got me a lot of paper. One score with you, I made more money than I ever did, hustle. Yeah, I mean, I'm a great thief, but you know, it's the other shit that I ain't got figured out. So what's the deal, man? What's the deal with the bureau, man? This clown. I mean, he's an okay guy, fucking cocksucker. We did a deal a long time ago. Didn't go quite the way it was supposed to go. Wrong guy got killed. So I had to go into kind of a, an informal witness protection program. He helped me. I didn't reveal secrets of his. Everything was cool. Problem started when recently I became unretired. I mean, he shows up, starts calling in favors, telling me to do shit. I mean, look, Franklin, I'm working for the fucking feds. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, fuck, man. Yeah, and that ain't even the worst part. <sighs> Did I ever tell you about Trevor? Hmm? Uh, man, I, I think so. Shit. Well, if you only think so, then I wasn't being completely honest. He's. I don't. Hell walking on earth. That's what he is. Well, let's bury this motherfucker. 
Oh, yeah, good luck with that. Shit. Now, Trevor and I got history. Complicated fucking history. Look, I've done a lot of things that I ain't proud of. Yeah, I never claimed to be an angel. But you meet Trevor Franklin. You'll swear I am an angel. So what's the move then, man? I don't know. Fuck. I'm just gonna, you know, try to play both sides. You know, until I can find a way out of this shit. All right, man, look, man, you help me. The way I see it, man, the least I can do is help you. It's a death sentence, Frank. Man, I, I, I ain't trying to hear all that shit, man. If the bureau ain't gonna take you to court, them motherfuckers just hustlers anyway. And I ain't finna let no motherfucking cat think he's so motherfucking crazy run me up a tree. Fuck that. Hey, you're a good kid, Frank. This means a lot to me. I told you, I'm a terrific thief. I'll find something for you. Big. Come on. You better take off. Alright, man. I'm with you. I'm with you. Michael. David. Well, isn't this nice? You didn't tell me we were double dating. Sorry, guys. This bar and hunk of love is all mine. <laughs> Brilliant. Steve Haynes, amigo, but you probably knew that already. Sorry, your name tag must have fallen off. Oh, duh. I love it. I, I, I gotta remember to write that down. And to shoot you in your head, you annoying dick. <laughs> Andres. Taking notes? This stuff. Whoa! Pure magic. I should put it on my show. Have you seen my show? You mean how to dress like a salesman on a cheap golf weekend at a third-rate country club? <laughs> so! Well done with our, uh, our friend, Mr. K. My pleasure. Uh, I love helping our government wage war, especially with itself. But you made a mistake. Did I, Cupcake? Why don't you keep your fucking voice down before I close your fucking windpipe? The joke stopped now, pal. You will show me and my team some respect. Maybe you could define team for me. Is that just the three of you? Or the greater FIV? Or the entire government? Because I'm tempted to argue that thus far, we haven't shown a lot of your colleagues a whole lot of respect. <laughs> Why don't you start with me, genius? You got it, pal.
We have received intel that they're keeping Mr. K at the local agency station. I just dealt with that guy. The agency is stepping up their questioning because of your moronic antics down at the coroner's office. We need to get him out of there before he blabs. I did what Agent Norton said. Then I guess you getting involved with a clapped out old agent who's been living off of past glories was your first mistake. You are my boy now. My career depends on this, and that's very important to me. So seeing as we're all boys now, that makes it important to you. Now run along, kids. See, there you go, Dave. You can't teach an old dog new tricks. Come on. The Bureau owns a lot out in East L.S. Covington supplies off El Rancho. Can you take us there? Yeah, sure. Sounds nice and secluded. Kind of place you'd run an off-the-books operation, huh? So what? So I bet federal ain't on the deed. That's so. And we all like our federal government open and transparent. Except when closed and opaque suits you better. Hey, I'm just a puppet. You're the one pulling the strings. Nice car. Taxpayers treating you right. I need you to make a couple of calls. Get some people on board. First guy is Franklin Clinton. Hey, I barely know that kid. He's fixing up my car. Call him, or we'll send some G-men to his aunt's house. Okay. Okay. Mike. Now, Trevor Phillips. Oh, you're crazy. I ain't calling him. I thought you might say that, so we had him picked up. That's a dumb move, Dave. Real fucking dumb. Just worry about the plan, okay? Getting Mr. K out of the IAA station. Clinton is going to be positioned across the street, keeping an eye on the proceedings. Phillips flies you in, you rappel down, make the extraction. And I'm the best guy you got for this. With you, we've got good leverage. Great! And you brought Trevor in. We're telling him I'm all cozy with the F5B. You'll need discreet support. We'll maintain control of the situation. Discreet? Control? Yeah, good luck controlling discreet Trevor. Now, I wonder how controllable and discreet he'll be when he sees the guy who killed me and put Brad in jail. You know what? You better keep a low profile. Yeah, I think I will. See you later. Who's that cagey motherfucker, huh? No, it's another cagey motherfucker, all right? Not you! Hey, T, enough with the faux political bullshit. <sighs> Franklin, come on, you better take off. Really? Shit, I'm good. I ain't built. Whoa. Well, am I detecting some, uh, some sort of, uh, son I never had bullshit here, Mikey, huh? Hey, listen. If you want to replace some father figure, you can do a lot better than this fat snake, all right? This fucker would eat his own kids. Like I said, Michael, deranged. Yeah, and best friend. <laughs> exactly. That's Trevor, my best friend. That's Franklin, the son I always wanted. All right, guys, listen, this is the shot. I'm gonna do all the heavy lifting on this job, okay? Trevor, all I need you to do is fly me to the target. Franklin, you're gonna cover me from across the street. We're gonna make these assholes happy and we'll walk away from this thing clean. Got it? Got okay. it. All right. Then we do this and they help us with that. Yeah. We'll talk about Brad later. All right? I gotta change. We better grab a head start. Nice to meet you, homie. Yeah, whatever. The government gimp at last. Eh, yeah, bite me. Let's go! Uh, all right, let's do this thing. We need to go to the agency headquarters downtown. Your new friends are a riot. No wonder you said sayonara to the old crew. Walking away ain't easy, Trev. Sometimes I guess you gotta make compromises. What happened to dying with a gun in your hand? Life happened. Annoying wife, two kids. Remember them? You get tied down, you can't move anymore. What about your ties to me? To Brad? Those ties are why you got roped in on this FIB instigated suicide pact. For as long as it keeps me amused, I am. I ain't exactly sure it's gonna be amusing. We'll see. You know, you had me at suicide pact. The access point is on the west side of the tower. Get us in position so 
trying to repel now. You fuck around while I'm out there. I'll climb back up this rope and strangle you with it. Yeah. so far up your ass, your tonsils will be playing shadow puppets. You think we can't do that? We can. It's in our guidelines. I don't know what you're talking about. I install cinema equipment, not surveillance. Grab his other arm. No, 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 no. Oh, 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 oh. Six flow. I got you. Don't harm the asset. Oh, shit. Go, go shoot me. I guess. All right, Jerry, I'll see you later. Oh, you better believe it, buddy.
Man, I'm drunk. But, shit, I ain't getting drunker. sister. I'm Denise, Franklin's housemate. And aunt, my mother's old dried up ass Shut sister. the fuck up. Yeah, shut the fuck up. Here, darling. Why don't you go get yourself something nice, okay? Thank you. <laughs> is, is this seven dollars? I said something nice, not expensive. You want to be a greedy fucking cow, huh? No. Get the fuck out of here, right? You men are all the same. Man, what the fuck you doing here? Here with the boy. The boys. What? I'm fucking new in town. I'm making friends, all right? Now let's party. Look, I had plans on getting some rest until this clown and my aunt came and fucked that up. My nigga, I just came over here to holler at you about the little thing. Man, I said I'm tired, dog. What fucking thing? I love things. I'm the king of things. I ain't talking to you, homie. Hey, let's go do something about the thing, okay? What thing? Fuck the little stretch thing, man. Fucking beautiful. Perfect. It's a gangbang. Let's go. Come on. Man, just come on. Where's this thing happening? Down Grove Street. We shooting shit up, spraying some motherfuckers. I can drive by with the best of them. Behave yourself, man. Lamar, what's happening? What you and stress set up? We buying weight, huh? Something that'll move us up the food chain, nigga, for real. Not this real in this town, nigga. Particularly where you and stress concerned. Man, this is an investment opportunity. You got to speculate to accumulate. Ooh, first rule of business. Hey, since we're out here banging, either you got some dust. Fool want to get butt naked? <laughs> I'll get whatever it takes me, old boy. This the homie house right here. Hey, look, everybody be cool, man. The more about to do his thing, all right? Now we talking. <laughs> My throat getting numb already. So we good, nigga, right? Well, let's go. How about a taste? No, man, we leaving. I want a taste of the other side of the brick. Now you heard what your boy said, you leave. Give me that, give me that. Whoa. What the fuck? We ask for a key or a fucking ounce. Man, that's motherfucking drywall. Hey, we got some motherfucking buyer's remorse out here. You can't fucking hustle a hustler. Ah. 
lucky miss! Good guy. He cried family and got kicked and he froze. So that, 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 that's it, right? Yes, Trevor. <laughs> but, but, but the thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy. And um, and Deborah, I mean, we're getting married, so. Oh, that's beautiful. But I'm scared that she's gonna leave me. I mean, this is her place. And the fornicating. There's Mr. Raspberry Jam. Whoa. Whoa. Now, Mr. Raspberry Jam. He died a noble death, bringing great joy to a lonely man. I ain't got a very big penis. Some girls laugh when they when they look at it. Show me! I don't want. Mine ain't nothing special. But this boy gets the job done. All right. Now, Wade here says that you work at the docks. Yes. Look at me! Can you just put your Johnson away, sir? Yes, I work at the docks. And? Anything uh, interesting there for a man like me? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't rightly... Rightly, no. I'm a person. I'm that kind of person, Wade. I am that kind of person. Now, let's get you, Wade, and that little tormentor down there. Put these on. We are going for a ride. Gentlemen, the gateway to America awaits. Front, we got an inside man at the port of LS. I'm gonna send you some information. I need you on point to help plan things. You know where the port is? Come on then, Floyd. What you got for me? Like I said, I don't rightly know what we got. You're going to have to be more exact in your questioning, sir. Uh, we're looking for something to steal. Sir, I stole a pencil in elementary school, and I've been regretting it ever since. Boy, I got always work your stick in the mug. Look, the sir... Please, just tell me what you want, and I'll do my utmost to assist you in finding it. Here's the problem. I don't know what I want. It's a bit, well, like pornography or a perfect turd. I can't quite describe it, but I'll know it when I see it. You ain't aiding my comprehension. All right, all right. Well, how's this? $236 billion worth of cargo came through the port of Los Santos last year. He's real good with numbers. I don't want to hijack a truck full of pineapples, Floyd. You need to give us the inside track on what's coming through. Well, we don't know what's in the containers. They certainly don't put price tags on them. Well, have you noticed anything? Anything different? Anything that might indicate something? Well, there's been all these uh, Meriwether folks hanging around. Meriwether security consultants. Private army to the New World Order. My butt gone The folks up. waging outsourced shadow... That hurt my neck! ...outsourced shadow wars in 20 countries around the globe and recently cleared to operate on U.S. soil. That, um, sounds like them. So there's a private militia in the port. What are they guarding? This one freighter? I guess now that you mention it, it ain't quite right. A freighter. Perfect. Can I get on board? No, no, uh, they won't let you anywhere near it. They're kind of assholes about it, actually. 
Go park and get the dispatch. Uh, yep, will do. <laughs> Go park and get the dispatch. Here comes the soup. I gotta check in. Remember, Floyd, this can go real wrong real quick. It don't matter what went in his house, it matters what came out. What? We got a waste spillage and I got a slot on the cleanup crew. There is nothing that Wade here ain't gonna do for a warm meal. Hope you got a strong stomach, son. <laughs> Get in there. You gonna take me to see this freighter? Yeah, it's over here. You ever got helicopters coming in and out of here? You know, those big sky crane things that can pick up a whole container? Now, this is restricted airspace. They won't let anything out of here without clearance. They shoot it down if they have to. So how's a man in a hurry supposed to get in and out of this place? Well, we got a port that stretched to 50 feet. Now, what's the Coast Guard response like? Well, they got cutters, 45-foot response vessels, air support. You're not gonna move much faster than them, especially if you're carrying something. Maybe I'll have to saddle you up and ride you across the Miriam Turner overpass. I just said they have the water surface real covered. Okay. So that is the freighter I told you about. What do you think they got on it? We just stevedore them. We ain't meant to know what's in the containers. But? But these are marked military. Government. Anything weird about that? The government stuff is hot freight. Pulls up, goes right through. This stuff's just been sitting here. You are beginning to arouse my curiosity. Over there, two o'clock. Looks like Forrest got on the wrong side of some Merryweather guys. You! You! We need two guys on the handler. A couple of containers and baby got to be brought up to half. That ain't a question. Get on it. Now. You drive and I'll spot. I guess I got to pretend I'm a dock worker if I want to stay. How about I run that prick over in this thing? I thought you wanted to scope the place. We don't get the containers. They're going to check your car. Oh, I'm getting nervous. You're always nervous. Relax. Not always, sir. Just around you. And it's just Cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together. Stick to the story. He'll be fine. Boys on a waste clearance crew. Those are the containers in Bay B. Clap it on now. Okay, we got it. Let's take her down to Bay F. I know why they call them handlers, because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck I'm high as a kite. You should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate you under the influence if you're not careful. There it is. Now I guess we gotta get the other one. I'm gonna need a better view of that freighter. I'm sorry, but this is as close as you going to get. Nah, nah, nah. I need to take some pictures. Send them to my guy, Ron. I'll need a proper view. There's the cranes, but... Cranes! Perfect! Oh, shoot! Be careful. And attach it. Hey, whose dick you have to suck to get this job? Being a stevedore used to be back-breaking work. Now you're paid brain surgeon bucks to push an oversized shopping cart. I did not fellatiate no one to get this job. Deborah's old friends with the... Well, with the... With the... With the say no more. You didn't fellate no one, but darling Debbie probably did. She probably enjoyed it.
If my work here is done, I'm going up the gantry. Buddy. Hey, you need me to get your union rep up here right now? Sooner you get in the cab, sooner we can get out of here. He's on you. First, you gotta line up the cabin over the container. There's some lights on the spreader that should help with alignment. Looks like you're in line. You're in position, so drop the spreader down and secure the load. You got it. Now pick it up so it'll clear the other containers and move it down to the end. We need to go to the other end. Bay 5. Keep going! Keep going! There's the truck. Set it down gentle. You want to line it up with the frame of the truck. the kids.
Pepper, come on. I can take you over to the warehouse. We could use the big rig. It's on the other side of Port City. So they've been guarding one of them dry docks. We can take a look at it, but no one's allowed around there. Normal rules don't apply to us, Floyd. We're going in. I don't know. The rules applied to me my whole life. I like rules. And look at you. You're a failure. You're in a loveless relationship. What do you mean? Loveless? I love Deborah. If she loved you, she'd be here, wouldn't she? But she's not. Uh, you know I'm insecure. You've got a dead-end job. What? Dead-end? No. Floyd, it's dead-end. Being a unionized longshoreman's one of the best-paying jobs in the country. You tell people around La Puerta that's what you do, they're liable to rob you. They're so jealous. No one's jealous of you, Floyd. They pity you. You're abused by that woman. You're abused by these slave drivers. I mean, I've never worked so hard in my life. It ain't so bad. Uh, I've been doing this every day for 10 years, only usually with less of the criminality. You're wasting your life, Floyd. It's lucky we turned up when we did. Hey, 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 hey. You can't come through here. Restricted access. No entiendo. Ah, no understand you. Ah, manifesto. Manifesto say deliver here. Mm, hey, stop. Where the fuck Get back here. Oh, 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 back out. 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 Back out.
in the name of all things holy. I, I, I tried to stop it, but it just kept coming and coming. Oh, it's, they're there, Wade. Look, 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 it's a, Betty, you're just not cut out for honest work, all right? <laughs> Did you get what you needed? Yeah, 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 more or less. Yeah, I just got to uh, figure out a place to plan this now. All right, this will do. That woman ain't even fine. Ain't no one understands why Floyd lets her use him so. That's well, uh, low self-esteem, Wade. We got to build him back up. Now. And there, perfect. All right, so based on thing, thing. First one, there, now. Nice, so. It's gotta be the container, right? You and Floyd can help, and we'll bring up. Okay, all right. What is that smell? Oh, we are going straight to the local union rep. Wade here was injured in the performance of his duty. Human waste has seeped into his very pores, and I am sorry to say this, but I don't think he's ever gonna smell normal. You can't go to the union. You are union, all right? And you vouch for us, all right? You look at him, man. Smell him, no. smell him. No. No. Trevor, Trevor, uh, you're, you're planning a robbery on my place of work. You violated Mr. Raspberry Jam, and God alone knows what else. Damn it, Trevor. Look, my lady and my union, that's all I got. So why don't we just, uh, why don't we just let this all slide? Huh? You're comfortable with what's happened to your cousin? And so be it, all right? But I would give him a bath and rinse him off. No! No bath! wrong with you smoking in my house? You know, ever since that psychotic pal of yours turned up, you turned into an even bigger asshole. Thank you. Your support in my difficult times means the world to me. I've supported you. I left everything to come here with you, and still, that crazy bastard turns up. I'll handle it. How? I don't know. Oh, you know what? Just keep him away from me and the children, you low-life, whoremongering asswipe. Did someone say yoga? No, I think she said whoremongering asswipe. Hello, Fabian, darling. <laughs> Namaste, Amanda. Are we ready to practice? Yes. Oh, yeah, she's very centered. A regular oasis of peace and tranquility, this with one. anger issues and worse friends. No wonder I'm so upset. You too, please. Namaste. We practice. Miguel, join us, please. No, please, no. No, no. The yoga is for sharing. Come, come, let me get it. come. Awesome. So fast. If you can make me as happy and mellow as my wife, it would be a job well fucking done. We are all on our own journey. Today. No doubt. So why she drive a tank on hers? Perhaps the deal is your fertility matter. Now here is good. We have the sun and the Murabunda. Asshole. Now we begin with the Asshole. To the edge. This, we begin each sequence. 
出さないおいマウンテンはいうんドゥトワマウンテンエノスペルティスのショヘママンうんドゥどうどうしたの<笑> 
back into my pelvis. Back, back, back. Yes, there. Oh, 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 oh! What? Hey, enough of that! Ah! Yoga is the answer, Mikkel. But what is the question? Uh, why am I such a moron? We are leaving, and we are never coming back. Good. You are alone, you pathetic psychopath. Ugh, fuck you. And that phony French fucking yogi. Ah! Jimmy, you still here? James, leave me alone. Oh yeah, fuck you. You know what? If there was a rape button, I'd be used. Nice TV. Did I pay for that? Yeah, you smashed the other one, didn't you? All right, come on, I want to go for a ride. I gotta meet a friend. All right, so I'll go meet him with you. Come on, I want to get out of the house. I'm not going alone. Come on. Fucking bullshit! Bullshit? Threatening to molest your online buddies is bullshit. They're not my buddies. So where's your friend? Burger shot? Yeah, nice to see the kids are still hanging out at the burger joints. Me and the guys, we go down to the diner after class every day. We get milkshakes, fries. Ew, please. You know, you're really creeping me out. I'm trying to relate to you. No, you're trying to take me on some nostalgia trip. You're such a cliche. Oh, says the dope smoking, game playing, live at home world owes him a living millennial. I knew it. I knew it. The mask was gonna slip. The monster's been exposed. The hell are you talking about? The real you. That bitter, vindictive old man. You pretend you're being a father, but you hate me, don't you? I don't hate you, Jim. How many times? I love you. Look, you really have to meet my friend? Yeah, I really do. Then please don't get weird. For once in your life, don't be weird. <laughs> Yo, oh, man. <laughs> Ah, man, good to see you. What are you trying to trick to pay for this shit, huh? Hey, who's the old man? It's my dad. Oh, all right, Mr. DeSanto. <laughs> yeah, you the kid selling Jimmy pot by the pound? <laughs> ah, Jimmy, bro, your dad's funny, man. Come on, do this shit and let's get going. Oh, yeah, you, you got that other thing? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, man, what the fuck? Jimmy, just, just hold on a second. Oh, all right. Later on. Careful with that. Hey, let's bounce. Bounce. We're bouncing now. Is that what we're doing? Jesus fucking Christ. All righty then. Now what? Can we just get back to the house, please? So, uh, want a drink? I'm driving. Because normally you're such a between the white lines, friend to the pedestrian kind of guy. Fine. Give it here. This is Amanda. Unfortunately, I can't come to the phone right now. Namaste. I can't come to the phone right now. Namaste. I gotta stop. Oh, what was in there? It's harmless. Vets have been using it for decades. What? You anesthetize me? You fucking shit? I'm protecting you from yourself. Also, I took money from your bank account and I'm moving out, all right? What? You're too crazy, Dad. Goodbye. Jimmy!
Michael, I think you finally lost your mind. Your recent behavior and the company you've been keeping already had me very concerned. Now you've taken to attacking my Fabian, who is a close friend, and then Jimmy said you took drugs while driving him in your car. Well, we've decided to move out for a while. You promised me you'd change, and you haven't changed a bit. I know you say I always act like I'm in a movie. Well, this isn't that. I think I'm gonna speak to a lawyer. I'm just really confused. Please, don't try to contact us and try not to get yourself killed. Amanda. Fuck! It's the same. Sweet Jesus. What the hell are you doing? Oh, nothing. Are you taking a dump? Oh, why do you care, huh? What the fuck is wrong with you? Uh, I got abandonment issues. I see a shrink once a week. You know, fuck you. Yeah, well, you know, nothing like meeting a bunch of creeps from the government in a quiet building for someone to grow balls. Did you taste that last time I popped it? Boom! Oh, ladies! God, you asshole. You, you back there. I know you, but you? You, I don't know. Yeah, well, until I see reason otherwise, why don't we just keep it that way? Steve, what a pleasure, bro. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> It reminds me of one of those guys you see advertising pills for middle-aged men that can't get erections. <laughs> hey, Devin Weston is a very good friend of mine, so why don't you watch your tongue? Because let me tell you something, that guy gets more tail than, uh... <laughs> than a tail catcher! <laughs> I don't fucking remember that one. You, where did we meet? Nowhere, pal. Hey, oh. 
What are we doing here, huh? This. Is... Keep this little stuff away from me. No, oh, no, no, Ferdinand, he's gone. He's gone. It's okay, I've got some new friends here now. It's this okay. is Michael. And this, this is Trevor. No. Now our friend here, he claims he doesn't know I anything. Don't, I don't know anything. I don't know. I already told nothing. Nothing. I don't know anything. Please. 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 You know about the Azerbaijanis. Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do audiovisual, high-fi audiovisual. It's top man, good price. VIP. You know? Ooh, you're so. a fucking spy. <laughs> and the asswipes at the agency know this. So I need to know. What did you tell them? What did they tell you? Hmm? I told them what I tell you! Uh huh? I... Hey! Whoa, 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 what is this? The house in Rockwood Hill. The man who owns it. He works at the consulate. Oh, that's all I know! That's it. That's it! That's it! I go. You're gonna make him speak. No, 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 no. You two are gonna drive up to Rockford Hills. No. And when we find out which man is the man with the problem, you put him down. No, 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 no. Because no, I'm tired no. of these fucking nitwits at the agency no. taking all the glory. Let me go. All right. Fuck is all this, huh? I think it's a good time, buddy. You know? Time. Go for a drive. Wait, wait. No. You get to work, and uh, I'm not here. <laughs> the guy's your neighbor. Caesar's Place, Rockford Hills. Way to leave a paper trail. You dick! Yeah, the more I see of your boss, the more I like him. I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. So is he gonna be a problem? For sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit. And that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh, well, boo hoo 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 for you. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after you put out your press release. Tom. Townley's taking scores again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. Anyway, any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walk your crew into an ambush. One of them spent 10 years on the run. And the other, Look out! And the other landed in a federal penitentiary. Or, or, we stumbled on the cash depot job. Brad went down, you went down. Trevor got away. This is bullshit. This place? Davey, they've been shooting the real cunts of suburbia here the last few weeks. No way that's your guy. Shit. You are kidding me. I'll call Steve. Wrong house. This guy isn't our guy. Okay, okay, okay. You sure you don't silence him just to make sure? You're silencing someone. You're silencing the right someone. Get me another address. Hey, you want a coffee? Turns out that was the wrong Azerbaijani. We need a new address for Mr. K. Choose your instrument and go to work on it. Where do we start, eh, buddy? Wait, what are you talking about, the wrong guy? No, who do you want? Just tell me what you want, huh, man? Huh, please, look at me, please. You'll barely feel a thing. I will, I will. Be gentle. Please don't hit me. No, no. I hope you're not a skier. Mr. Phillips, ask him about Tay here. Oh. Java. Why didn't you ask me? I know Tay here. Uh, I did his home theater. He lives in Chumash. What? 
Is it the Western Highway? Oh, that wasn't so tough, was it? Huh? <laughs> Did you get that? Did you hear him? Lives in Chumash, the Western Highway. Chumash, you're driving. Remember, terror does not take coffee breaks. <sighs> what a dick. <laughs> Trying to find my way back home to you I'm so alone Nothing feels like home I'm so alone So how are Steve and Trevor getting along? Seems like a productive relationship. Yeah, you know, like I said, he's got his uses. And as you can see, we're trying to take full advantage of him. Then what? This thing with the... Hey! The car! This thing with the agency gets put to rest and we don't need you anymore. Right. And what about Trevor? What about him? I need some resolution, Davey. You let him walk. You said you'd clean the whole thing up back in North Yankton. And you told me it'd be a clean job, no casualties. There were more eyes on that town than there needs to be. Yeah, well, according to my eyes, Trevor's your problem, Dave, as much as he is mine. He's not a problem at all. We're monitoring him. Has he said anything about Brad? Fuck yeah, he has. Plenty. I keep changing the subject. You know, he thinks you might actually commute Brad's sentence when this is all over. That's good. Fine work. We'll send another letter. It's about time anyway. Oh, so that's you who's been sending those fucking letters to Trevor, huh? Yeah. He thinks they're from Brad, who he thinks is locked up in high security and not... This is good. All right. Find out who we're looking for. Yeah, we need a description of the target. Yeah, uh, I'll take care of it. Loosen him up. Oh, no, no, please. I tell what? you what you Loosen want him up. No, please. The anticipation is always worse. Really? Oh, uh, not the wrench. The bullseye. <laughs> Hey, 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 hey. Now? Huh? Now? You ready to talk? I've been ready to talk since the day I got kidnapped six weeks That's ago. That's what we were afraid of. No, I mean... So, yeah, 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 this guy we're after, what does he look like? Average build? Come on. Average height? Middle age? Yeah, yeah, it sounds like your stalling's gonna okay. be enough. Middle age, middle height, middle build, whatever, he's dark. Okay, he's Azerbaijani, for God's sakes. Look around, that enough for you? You're my eyes, tell me, what do you see? I see a couple guys that are way too old and... What the hell? That was the guy. I had a feeling. It'll check out. Well, we've... Got him. It's done. Woo! That is a wrap, my friends. Excellent work, the pair of you. Now, I got a rapid ball game to get to, so Trevor, if you take care of Mr. K, I think we're all set. What the fuck do you want me to do with him? I would say he's outlived his usefulness. Oh, come on, please. Shut up! That's a sport. Let's just go, okay? I ain't gonna let those G-Man fucking scumbags tell me what to do. <laughs> just torture me. Don't ask too many fucking questions. Let's go, get up. Come on, up the fucking stairs. <laughs> Ow. Fuck's sakes. Come on. Let's go. All right. Now you got a flight to catch, okay? To get you to the air. Oh, safety first. How you feeling? I need to get to the hospital. Yeah, you're fine. I can assure you. I am not. No one likes a crybaby. You look great. Let me see the mirror. I think I need a hospital! You're not going to a hospital! You need to leave. Who are you? And why are you helping me? I told you, I don't like being told what to do. Then why are you working with FIB? I'm a double agent. Yeah? Now who you work for? IAA? The IAA want you dead as well, Ooh. don't you remember? The Marshal? Global Pool? Who? Global Pool? Did you say Global Pooh? I work for the forces of sanity. 
society? And we need you to tell the world what happened to you from the safety of a foreign country, preferably a dictatorship. What do you mean? Departures. No one drives them. It would be. Run. You're free. But my family's here. Your family is probably the ones who got you fucking in here, all right? Now look, trust no one, all right? You're alone now. Really? Yeah, really. Now let's go. Fuck off. Come on. Oh. 